Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. Don't stand in front of it. There you go. Let's go get desperate now. He's coming forward now because he has to. Be careful. And catch him when he comes forward. Catch him. Jab. Jab. And throw. Throw to the body, then to the head. You need to move your head more, okay? Side to side. Lean to the side, then boom! Counter punch. Counter punch. Okay, we got this yeah. Last round, and it's yours, okay? Just keep your distance you and keep your hands keep your up. Hand, let's go. You win this round. There you go, you win this You got this! You got this! 
one, baby. All right, fellas, let's have a good clean fight. Touch them up and let's go. Listen, I need to see some counter punches, okay? Whatever he misses, counter. There you go. You are looking good, real good out there. Look at him, he's tired. He's real tired. He's got nothing left. I got more. Now listen, I need you to double up on your punches and keep that lead fired, all right? Okay, listen, you can throw him off with some head movement. I mean, that's it. Throw him off with head movements.
fighting his fight. You're fighting on the inside with this guy. I want you to use the ring and keep your distance. You have to start throwing in volume in there. Throw in volume. You don't need that. Throw that away. Keep smart. That's it. Last round, all right? Keep smart and you got this one. Throw it. got to fight this round, baby. Don't look for just big punches, okay? Use your speed. Double up on your punches. I want to see some combos. Yeah, we'll get him. Okay. This is what champions are made of. Okay, listen. All right, gentlemen, protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch them up. Enough punches, okay? Beautiful. 
Beautiful, nice movement there. Keep that up. Now keep moving. Keep moving. Throw that in. I got more. No, throw them in there. Yeah. Okay, listen to me. When he misses you with a punch, counter! Counter! I need you to throw more punches. Okay, guys, we went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's touch gloves. And there's 
the opening bell. Round number one, scheduled for four. This one is expected to be a thriller. We spend so much time talking about all the facets of the game, but confidence, the mentality, just simply being a winner. Williamson's perfect record plays into that. And he wants to keep that, and that's so important. When he's in a tough fight, when he's in those tough moments, he just doesn't want to give that up. Scores up top with a left. Williamson's well off the mark that time. Accurate shot, straight right hand comes in. Solid uppercut. Wow, what an uppercut. Buster's so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. Nice defense. Good block by Williamson. Comes right back at him with a left hand. I think you can just sense right away that strategy is going to be key here. This isn't going to be some wild type draw. This is going to be a very technical, strategic type fight. Absolutely, Joe. Each guy waiting for the other one to make the first They're mistake. Right. Williamson's got nobody to blame but himself. I mean, he got hit much too much in that last round. Well, he was throwing his punches around, from man. too close. He's giving up his height. You're throwing you from that close, and, and you're going to get counted over it. If to your body. opponent Shot wants to do that, right guess what? His body. opponent He's wanted to. He had the desire to do that, and he took advantage. And side to side. You understand? You got to breathe. Just breathe, relax. Right. How you feeling out there? You know, you're not winning this fight, right? Here we go. Round two is underway. Buster's doing what every trainer wants to see their fighter do. Land punches and bunches. The combination lands. Young's jab on the outside. That has really been the difference maker here, hasn't it, Teddy? Yes, it has. But the most important thing is, you know, everybody says, hey, just use your jab. You control the outside. Hey, jab's a great weapon, but it can be very dangerous. You throw it from a little too close, you can get counted with that right hand. He's thrown it at the perfect distance, getting full extension on that punch. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Williamson. Boy, that worked out well with the uppercut. That's where you want to be. That's an impactful right hand by Williamson. A solid true uppercut by Williamson. Scores with the combo to the head. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Took a shot. Now he gives a left. The end to another very entertaining round in what has been a very entertaining fight. A fight where there's just bad intentions. The fight that just doesn't have the feel of a fight that's going to be a decision win for somebody. Looks like somebody's going to get stopped. Right from the beginning, they've been fighting with desperation. Like, going the decision, as you just touched on, has not been in their minds at all. Nice. You need to cover up more, okay? You're leaving yourself open too much. Just cover up. Yeah. And round number three is underway. Good right hand. Little setup punch. One, two, two jabs to the body. Get back off the rope. Able to get away from that headshot with the block. Just not there. Straight right hand off the mark. Two good jabs by Young. Little head hunting with the left. Hooks on the inside. Williamson's corner 
has to give him some advice here because that left hand has been scoring too consistently. Exactly, Joe, and there's nothing else that he really has to worry about. Take that out of the equation, he'd be winning the fight. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. Well timed by Young. He took a step back, landed the counter punch. Exactly what he wanted to do. Good flush, straight left hand. I like the way that jab is doubled up by Young. And we come to the end okay. of the round. We got this. Last round, it's your. Here you go. Okay. Keep your distance. Listen, I want you to pick his jabs. When, when he throws a jab, parry it away and you'll catch him, okay? You got that? It's going to happen. You're going to catch him. All right, last round. Okay. You have this. No need to get careless. Don't get caught. Nine long. This is your fight. You need to capitalize on his misses, okay? I want to see that counter hook. Make him pay for his misses. They put forth a good effort throughout. Now one more meeting. The final round is here. You see, he sits and waits and then strikes with that counter punch by Young. Good defensive skill. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. Solid right by Williamson. Right hand over the top, very accurate with it. That straight right, unable to connect. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after it tagged himself. Young's strategy has been to control things on the outside. And the jab fits perfectly into it. Yeah, what it's done is it's set up his defense, it's kept his opponent defensive, kept him off balance, off strike, and it's also set up his power shots whenever he's wanted to. Firing off the uppercuts, great exchange. And they will bring it home in the last 10 seconds of this final round. Well, you should have your judge's license taken away if you don't see this one the obvious way, Teddy. And one of these judges dare go another direction with this. I want their picture up on a post office board. The most wanted poster. Yes, sir. Now, right now, what we want is to hear those obvious scorecards, so let's send it up to the ring. Young's work tonight was well rewarded. A unanimous decision win. Teddy, you saw it all along. It was easy, and he saw it all along. That's the thing. He saw the punches coming all night long. He was good defensively, and he was good with that left hand. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Thanks for being with us. We'll see you next time ringside.